that tradition dates back to 1864 and that tradition still continues today. And even though several weeks ago, dozens of Civil War gravestones were vandalized, the community did not let that rattle the Memorial Day celebration. Today we pause to remember those who have given their lives in service to our country. All of our veterans need to be honored every single year. The holiday's origin lies in the Civil War and Bullsburg lays claim to the birthplace of this special day. 150 years ago, three Bullsburg women decorated the graves of those dead soldiers with flowers. And that tradition is still being honored today. Pennsylvania Governor Tom Corbett was the featured speaker at the event. The tradition that started here has inspired a nation to remember, to remember the men and women who will forever rest in our soil facing an American sky. For the Canizero family, celebrating Memorial Day in Bullsburg is a family tradition, but it's become even more sacred as one of their own has taken the oath to protect and serve country. Several weeks ago, the community was devastated when vandals destroyed dozens of graves, some dating back to the Civil War. The community has rallied together, not allowing this act of disrespect to take away from the celebration. The cemetery where there were vandalized headstones made me very sad and disappointed to see the damage. What I saw was the opposite meaning of Memorial Day, which is about respect. Showing respect can be an action as small as laying flowers on the grave as three women did in Bullsburg 150 years ago. Each of us today should show respect to those who died fighting for this nation. Now that last speaker you just heard, she was the winner of the Memorial Day essay contest. And those are such wise words coming from such a young lady. Reporting live in the Center County Newsroom, Lauren Hensley, 6 News.